make sure your collars are where you want them. So if you need adjusting, do it now. For standard, I'm not going to OB. There should be a part that is half width. And then a part that will be full width. Mine is unsewn. You can see this. Here. Take the half width side of the OB. The part that is open. And put it towards your neck and over your left shoulder. Take the OB. Bring it around. One. Second layer, grab your obita. If it is not sewn, put it inside the layer. If it's sewn, put it between the layers. Grab the undermost layer again and pull the top. Grab a clip of some sort. side, right, up on your back. Hold that side and grab your hemo. Grab it and pull it. Bring it around and tie it. Then tuck the hemo. Another large clip and clip this part. Grab your Obi Makura. And tuck in the tie. If the OB needs adjusting, flip it. Obiage. And fold one side over. Take the Obiage. Or the Obiage. And cover the Makara. Temporarily tied in front. Take the short side of the OB and bring it over. Put it in line with the part around your waist. Bring it out and grab the long end. And tuck. And bring the rest of the OB up.
little part of the OB, peek out, a little less than a finger's length. through the drum to hold everything in the meanwhile. Grab your OBG man. Thread it through the psycho. Bring in the front. Make both sides even. Grab the center, bring the left and under, and tighten, make a loop with the left hand, bring the right side under and up through, twist the left side, and hold the center while you tie it. Take the ends and tuck them in. Take the short side of your obi, just thread it through the drum, and pull it down to make the drum taut. Take your obiage. Bring the underside in one third and the top side one third. Then even it out to the back. Then fold the whole thing in half. Then run your fingers through it. Make it even. Take that in. Side. Do the same with the left, right, one third in, bring it back, one third in, bring it back, one half. Bring the left side over the and up under. side that's over and make them straight up and down. Take the right side and make a triangle. Bring the left side in and pull. Put your finger in the knot and pull it slowly. So when you tie it, you have a flat part. Take the sides of the OB and OB OB and tuck them in. Tuck the knot so it's peeking out, and then run your finger between the obiage and the obi. Make sure a little bit's peeking out. Take your ohashwari. Make sure it's taut and there's no wrinkles in front. If there's too much fabric, use the taiko to cover up any excess and pull it towards the back.